there, hope you guys are doing awesome. Today we're gonna to be talking about cleaning our liners. When and how often do you wanna be cleaning your liner? You wanna be cleaning these daily. If it's at the end of the day or if you shower at the end of the day, you can make it part of your nighttime routine and just wash this in the shower or at a sink. You wanna start by turning this liner inside out. You want to be inspecting the whole liner for any cracks or any discoloration. And you can see this one is starting to dry out and get some cracking. If you are getting any of that cracking or any discoloration, that's usually when you want to replace the liner. You do get two liners and most of the time you're going to hear, oh, so that's you can wear one and wash one. Typically I'm recommending my patients to wear their liner straight until it wears out and then move into that fresh new liner. If you're getting areas of discoloration in one particular area, especially if it's on a bony area, let your prosthetist know because that's usually indication of a high pressure area and that the socket can use some fine tuning adjustments. So we got the liner inside out, we've done the visual inspection. So now what do we use to wash the liner? Couple things, there's some companies that make a cleanser specific for liners. Typically though, I'm always recommending Dawn dish soap. Aside from those two, you can use a soap that you typically wash your body with because you know your skin is used to it. It's not gonna most likely react to it. You just wanna make sure that you avoid harsh antibacterial soaps or soaps with fragrance or perfume, that's just gonna open the door for potential skin irritation. So lukewarm water. and we're just scrubbing down the liner, getting all the areas clean. And you wanna make sure that it is rinsed really thoroughly. You don't wanna have any soap residue. So now that the liner is washed, how do we dry it? Some liners do come with a stand that you just turn it right side out and set it on the stand. If you don't have one of those, you can use a broom handle, a wine bottle, paper towel holder, um, anything like that. Typically though, I recommend turning it back right side out and laying it flat to dry. But you can also just take a paper towel and pack dry or any non-lint towel. And you're good to go. Or like I said, if it's at the end of the day and you're done wearing your prosthesis, just turn it right side out and lay it flat on the counter to dry overnight. And no need to worry about the outside getting wet. So it is really important to wash liners every day just to prevent any possible skin irritation, rash, infection, and also prevent it from getting smelly. If you're washing your liner daily and still have kind of a little bit of a funk, can once a week spray a little bit of isopropyl alcohol, let it set for a minute and make sure that that gets rinsed off thoroughly. You just don't wanna do that too often if you don't have to and just make sure that, that you rinse it off and the alcohol doesn't dry on the liner because that will cause it to dry out, crack, wear out faster. If you have any other questions about liners, cleaning liners, or just prosthetics in general, just drop them down in the comments and let me know. And you guys have a beautiful day.